Good afternoon. My name is my name is Kerry Carter. I'm with Atavis. We're a Seattle-based company. Uh, we use data and analytics. Oh, sorry, go ahead. We use data and analytics uh, to solve one of the most talked about problems in sports today. Uh, the NFL, we all know, is one of the uh, the most profitable and most profitable and popular sports in in the country. But uh, we see that all this momentum that the NFL has over the last few years has been tremendous, and it continues to grow. The sport continues to grow. But we do see that there has been some issues in the, in the last few years, and the NFL does have a problem when it comes to ratings. Everyone talks about ratings this year, and we look at also uh, the viewership is declined and youth sports. You know, we're looking at the signups, and the signups are declining over the last few years as we look at these numbers. The most talked about issue right now has to do with the focus on concussions, on head injuries. So right now, as we, as we think about the temperature of sports today and football specifically, the, the talk is around player safety. And as we look at player safety, there's two sides to it. The NFL is doing everything that it can to put new rules in place. And then we have a lot of technical entrepreneurs you know, developing great new products in order to try to tackle the issues that we're seeing when it comes to impact and head impact specifically. Uh, at Atavis, we believe in all of that. We've chosen to go upstream from that problem and focus on technique. What we've done is we've, we have created the Atavis Tackle System. It is a rugby style shoulder led technique combined with uh, an analytics and reporting tool that is really meant to change behavior. So ultimately what we've done is given you the data in order to teach a safer and more efficient tackle. The game is changing, and right now there's a lot of talk about rugby tackling, uh, in, uh, in large part due to what the Seahawks have put together with the Hawk tackle over the last few years. It's become very prevalent, very popular. Uh, our roots are in rugby, and we feel like we have the expertise to speak to this subject specifically. In rugby, there are hundreds of tackles over an 80-minute 80 uh, 80 match, all with no protective equipment. And what we see, the biggest difference is that in rugby, the head is out of the tackle and the shoulder is in. Our, our rugby roots led us to Pete Carroll. You know, we invited uh, some of the group over to training camp back in 2012, and we are able to uh, work with the Seahawks. We sent some of our Olympic-level uh, uh, rugby coaches over there, and they work with them and you know, work with Rocky Sato and their team as they you know, really mastered this hawk tackle and, and put it out to the public. You know, on, their, on their championship run, they were nice enough to give us a little shout out. You know, we, we see John, uh, John Gruden here giving us a shout out on Monday Night Football. They wrote a little article in the New York Times and we knew we were onto something. The phone started ringing. So what do we do with this? What do we do with this opportunity? We knew that we could break down the tackle. We could make it measurable and quantifiable. We knew that we could take the head out of the contact area while still increasing efficiency. We created, we created the Atavis Tackle System. We use this to create a process to sequence and progress skills. Next, we built the online training program which was meant to deliver remote access to all of the skills that we're teaching. In addition to this, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> In addition to this, we took the two aspects of the tackle, so the track, everything leading up to the tackle in order to, uh, in order to really maximize contact, and then everything after that, the tackle, which is meant to really focus on the elements of power and control. Reminder that everything that we do with our tackle system is meant to help change behavior. Most importantly, we built Tacklytics. Tacklytics is our online grading and reporting tool. In this past year, 2016, we graded uh, just over 4,000 or so tackles. And with this, we're able to see a lot, we're able to understand how things have kind of grown and, and we're able, to, we're able to take Tacklytics, and, I'm sorry, I'm gonna keep moving on. 
I know my time is going down here. Our analysts use Tacklytics to grade, to grade tackles and also to spot trends. Coaches use Tacklytics to receive their weekly reports. In 2015, we saw, I'm gonna move ahead, I'm sorry, there's not a lot of time left. Uh, in 2015, we worked with the Ohio State Buckeyes. That was the first team that we we're, were able to deliver a report to. With, with the Ohio State Buckeyes, what we saw is we took this entire ream of data, put it on their, on their desk, and they you know, thumbed through it, put it back to us, and said, what does it mean? And that was our seminal moment. That's where we understood that. It didn't matter you know, how much data we put in front of you. What really mattered is the quality of that data and the recommendations that we needed. And that's what we put in front of them were recommendations moving forward. I'll skip through some of this, as I know you guys want to get to the questions. Uh, some of the teams that we worked with here over the last few years. And I'll get to what's next. So we feel like we can really move towards machine learning. We could speed up our process internally. We can use some of the data to now guide some of the actions on offense in terms of game planning and scheming. And then we also feel like we can use a lot of the data uh, to partner with other organizations uh, that have sensor data, GPS, and shock data. Thank you, Adivis. We'll Sorry. take questions from the judges. So I guess the first question I have, just um, real simply, is it a service? Is it a consulting service, a technique service? Yeah. Is it actually a product? Is there technology? Like, what is the actual product that yeah. you're selling? Yeah, so the, the product is our online tacklelytics platform that we use to analyze the tackles. Our service is what we actually sell. So we work so, with... So sorry, just there. So you're taking the video, and yes. then someone's looking at the video after it's been produced, and then, and then rating it vis-a-vis -vis yes. sort of a system, and then sending And then a producing a report. The, okay. So we have an online training program that can be accessed from any level, so as low as, uh, you know, from the youth level all the way up to the NFL. But what we do for our, our kind of high-level clients, uh, college, NFL, we do year-round consulting. So we work with them in the spring, summer, fall, analyze practices, games, and give them weekly reports that they can then use in order to uh, put together a practice plan progression so that they can get better that next week, not, you know, next month, not after the season. Got it. Uh, how do you scale the supply side of your experts? So you, you have to have yeah. You, you, yeah. So a million tackles a week is not going to be working, right? But yeah, so we, we have an internal training system. It's called Tackle U, so we're able to get the analysts in there. We have junior analysts, analysts, senior analysts, and then we have coach analysts as well. So all three of those levels, we're able to actually bring them in and really get them schooled up in a short amount of time so that they can start entering that data as well. But we're also moving towards more machine learning so that we can speed up our process and recognize a lot of the trends as we get an increasing amount of data in so that when we produce our output and our reports, which is really the, the product, we're able to, in the end, you know, speed that entire process up so we can expand what we do to and offer the service to more people on a bigger the, level. What would you say kind of ratio of your, I, I see my question, is a service or, you know, how much of that is kind of technology-based, license-based versus professional services, if you will. I'm trying to simplify it. Yeah, so we have a licensing model, so a yearly renewal uh, license for uh, two products, our online training program. And most of the clients that we work with on the college level uh, do annual or two or three year sub, um, contracts with us, so we'll work with them for a few years. Um, first of all, I think it's great that you're operating in this space. Yeah. So how do you, um, once you've, uh, imparted the wisdom to the coaches, mm -hmm. right, and they've adopted the technique. And most teams now are evolving in terms of sophistication, so they have their own in-house analytics department. They yep. have a lot more toys and tools to play with. How do you mm -hmm. prevent yourself from just being dis disintermediated after six months of work? Yeah, so we, we, we talk about that quite a bit. And, you know, part of it is that internal training, so being able to train them on what to look for, but then also the time that it takes, you know, what we're seeing with a lot of the colleges, they just don't have the staffing in order to keep up with the type of data that we're producing and then the reports. So we're able to, you know, give them more and we become the platform of choice rather than them, you know, adding a, a GA or, you know, an assistant coach to it. They actually utilize our service in order to expand and we become an extension of their coaching staff. Uh, so we, we have a mixture of both football and rugby, you know, specialist coaches. Uh, we're led by Karen Bryant. Uh, she was a former CEO of the Seattle, uh, Seattle Storm for about 15 years. She's our president. 
Um, so we have a kind of a mixture of both football experience, rugby experience, tech, uh, technology, and marketing experience. So I don't know if you're going to win the competition, but I'll, I'll let you uh, pitch the Dolphins, too, because I love Pete Carroll. <laughs> so if Pete Carroll's doing something, I want to take a look at it. All right? All right. I'll All right. be there. Good. All right. Thank you. Great. Thank you very much, Atavis. Yeah.